Vogue. Uh, high energy, stylish, cool, fun. Uh, the musical Six tells the story of six wives of Britain's King Henry VIII by giving the queens their own really voice. Uh, two of the cast members are here, uh, Zan Baruby and Aline Maya Gortia, uh, Maya Gortia, and she, they are both here, and I probably did your name in, in justice, but I appreciate you both coming in. Thank because... I don't know anything about it. All you guys, all of you guys from here over went to U of M, including our own brother. They were like, is anybody here a U of M grad? We need you for an interview. And that was a great lead-in. You really got it there. I've been to a few games. It's so much fun. But how cool is it to have uh, that in common with a cast member that you both went to a great theater program yeah. at the University of, of Michigan, Ellie. I mean, we reconnected at the audition, actually, at one of the callbacks. I walked in and I saw Zan. I know her! <laughs> and that you guys actually know. knew each other when you were in school. Oh, she was a senior when I was a freshman. Oh, yeah. that's she awesome. She was a cool kid. <laughs> wow. But yeah, so we reconnected at the auditions and that really kind of set us at ease, you know, to mm -hmm. have, you know, familiar faces when you're really stressed. And mm -hmm. she killed it. I was like, Zan's getting this. Likewise. She's getting it. Likewise. <laughs> and then and, you know, once we started to hear the whispers of who got into this uh, national tour cast, you know, we were texting each other, and it was like, oh, yes, we get to do it together. It's so lucky. Is, yeah. it, is it, so when you come back home, because this is home, so when you, when you come back home, is it exciting because... I was at the show, and I heard when you said, go blue, go Tigers. You, you just <laughs> tied it in there so nicely. Of course. Like, you plan that stuff ahead of time. That's fun for you to do that, right? Of course, of course. Yeah, there's a little moment in the show where I get to shout out whatever I want. Yeah. And I already knew, obviously, <laughs> yeah. coming, coming back home here to Michigan, like, we had to say the go blue. What, well, when they go to Ohio, she ain't going to say yeah, the she's not gonna I'm see. telling you no, that no, right no, now. No, I'm going to say that. nothing. Don't right? I'm quitting Don't the show. <laughs> I, what stands out to me is how often uh, a Broadway show comes to town and there are U of M alums in that. What is it about that theater program that got you from Mexico City through Austin and got you from Boston to Ann Arbor to go to school? Yeah, I think it's an excellent community and definitely the professors. When I visited campus, I was like, these are the people I want to be surrounded by. These are the artists I want to learn from. Mm -hmm. We're always pushed to our fullest potential and always supported. So it's nothing like coming home. I feel so grateful to be back. And you run into people from U of M uh, on almost every playbill over in New York City. Yes. I mean, you really can't walk down in midtown Manhattan without running into so many people that we know. Mm -hmm. It's kind of impossible to find a show anywhere. I mean, even regional theaters, you know, all yeah, over the country, yeah. like, we're always there. And um, the person that founded that program, Professor mm -hmm. Brent Wagner, he yeah. actually came to see us. Nice. Last week. Oh, that's an that's so honor. Like, how nervous were you? So oh, nervous. my gosh. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I can mess up in front of my mom and dad, but not Professor Wagner. Got that. <laughs> and, and you know, it's so funny. It was before the show. I was like, "Am I really like finding truth in my acting? Am I singing? <laughs> is my placement okay? You know?" Like, yes, you it was more than okay. I was in the audience, and so was Derek. It, it was, was so such a good. fun show. It was such so a fun good. show. Um, what was so great about the show? And I don't know if this is. Do you guys try to pick shows with a message that you can relate to, or did it just happen to work out this way? Because this show is a great message. It is. It is. I mean, I think personally, when I first heard the show, I was a little bit like, what is this pop concert thing? Because I'm, you know, I'm a very, like, musical theater elitist <laughs> person. Oh, sure. I like the classics. <laughs> right. And then once, Yes. And then once I saw what the show was actually about and how smart it is in mm -hmm. saying, you know, this is a story of the six queens. What do we have today that kind of relates to that sort of queendom as well? It's pop stars. Mm -hmm. And that connection is so smart. It's such a good, tight concept. And it's executed perfectly. So. I love this show. I think it's one of the best yeah. contemporary musicals we have, like truly. We know, I feel like of the six wives, the, the most famous one, Dan Boleyn, Dan right? Boleyn, yeah. Right? <laughs> how, do you, how do you bring that? So like, sassy on stage. Too. <laughs> yeah, like, how do you, how do you, how do you make that? that a character? How do you make any of these people characters? Because they're so, 400 years ago or whatever it was, I... How do you make that a relevant today character? Absolutely. I think the fun part of the show is we get to bring a piece of ourselves mm. to the characters. And we did research and we bring a lot of the history to the stage. But I think I bring a lot of Zan's punk rock energy nice. as well as some Miley Cyrus and Avril nice. Lavigne nice. concepts to the show as well. All right. mm -hmm. uh, to, to end, please tell us uh, what, what wife do you play, starting with you? Zan. I'm Zan and I play Anne Boleyn. And I'm Aline Mayagoitia, and I play wife number five, Catherine Howard, who was 
Anne Boleyn's cousin. My cousin. Oh. <laughs> so that's also fun. Yes. And, and we both get beheaded. And once again, <laughs> that uh, is true. Is, I didn't connect that. This is Weather right. Authority Derek Kevin. And I play. Weather Derek Derek Kemp, Derek yeah, Kemp. that's right. Uh, yeah. Lee Thomas of Fox News, play reporter. Yes. And Love thanking it. you guys for coming in. We play two fans as well. This so show's thank you guys. amazing. Thank you. Show you guys amazing. have to go see it before it leaves yeah. Detroit. I'm serious. It is yes. such a fun, great show. Hopefully you're having a good time playing to your U of M people. Absolutely. Oh, we are. Good it's stuff. Good see you there. Good stuff, guys. Six, the musical running at the Fisher Theater through June 11th. You still have time to grab your tickets. You can go to Ticketmaster or BroadwayInDetroit.com. We'll be right back.